I have four children, and all of them have been born in Intermountain Healthcare facilities. And my oldest was born in 1997. In 1997, the Women in Newborn Clinical Program was just beginning. My next daughter was born in the year 2000, and, and then my third daughter in 2003, all of them at American Fork Hospital, which is an Intermountain Healthcare facility, and uh, OBGYN, you know, physicians that, uh, that were introduced in those years to these best practices. In particular, the best practice around not inducing labor because what medical literature had shown was that inducing labor prior to 39 weeks gestation was not a good thing for, ba for mother or baby. And well, why was it being done? Well, mothers like, to, like the idea of being able to schedule and know when that's gonna happen and not have to necessarily wait for nature to take its course. The physicians like that idea too because they could schedule around, you know, their babies come in all different, all different hours of the day and night. Intermountain Healthcare had on average over 20% of their elective inductions were prior to 39 weeks, which was the national average. And that led to higher costs, higher risk for patients and, and babies. Between my second and third daughters being born, uh, is when that best practice was introduced. And I remember my wife specifically mentioning that uh, I was at the, at the OBGYN appointment with her when she was told that she was not going to be able to schedule induction prior to, you know, 39 weeks gestation. She wasn't very happy about that because she thought, well, wait a second, you know, my previous two, I had that choice. You're, you're taking a choice away from me. But in the end, as it was explained that this is what is best for her and for her baby, she was okay with that. You know, as a father, that's what I, I, I just want a healthy wife and a healthy, a healthy child. And if that means having to wait a little bit to make sure that, uh, you know, that baby, mom and baby will be as healthy as possible, uh, that's what, uh, you know, that's all that I cared about at the time. Well, here we are you know, nearly 15 years later, and I believe we have cut out, um, you know, millions of, tens of millions of dollars of, of newborn ICU expenses, of respiratory problems for newborns, of heartache for, you know, for mothers and fathers of, of little newborns, uh, because this best practice has been implemented, and I personally was impacted by that, and, and, and appreciate the fact that, that Intermountain is focused on best pract clinical best practices and looking for better ways to treat, uh, to treat patients because those patients are, you know, my wife and, and children and loved ones that I care about greatly.